Alright then, boy, I am letting me come in it, and I'm going to be looking at the first play of Constructor HD, or the Constructor Remake, whatever you want to call it. This, to fans of Constructor, will know, this is the opening scene, they've given it a nice kind of HD lick, an over, overdue uh, remake, and uh, first impressions looks quite nice. The graphics suitably cartoony. Uh, I always thought this part was absolutely horrendous as a child playing this as a young kid being drowned in concrete. But they've, uh, as you can hear here, they've added in a little new song here to uh, add a comedic va value to it, so it doesn't seem quite so horrendous, I guess, being drowned in concrete. I mean, I'm not over the moon with the graphics. They're good. Uh, kind of nitpick. I don't know. The style on the other one was kind of nitty and gritty and dirty. They, they've still retained a bit of that. And, uh, yeah, who am I, what am I saying? It, it does still look kind of good. Um just we'll we'll see how the the actual game goes. I have played through the tutorial, and there isn't too much to complain about. There are a few little problems I ran into with it that you can't click through it. It does take you through it literally by baby steps. But let's have a look around. I mean, you've got a a nice kind of uh, semi-interactive menu going on in the background here. A few things uh, there to see. Uh, looks like you will be able to change the language and the voiceover as well in the full game, which would be nice. If you wanted to listen to, if you're from a different country, you do get, they've done the voice acting for it as well by the sounds of things, that's good. Nothing much in here that you wouldn't expect, I mean, uh, cursor speed, auto cancel, wow. That's, uh, that's nice, didn't know there was an explosion going on there. A lot of detail, a lot of detail put into this screen, I like that, okay, so, like I say, the tutorial, I mean, it, it, it takes quite a long time to play through because you can't skip it. So, I will just show uh, what you do get in the play game, you get about 12 minutes on there. Design, we don't know what that's going to be. The missions, that'll be like mob rule, hopefully. Low game multiplayer, so what you'd expect, that sounds pretty good. So let's get into this. Uh, all the undesirables. This is another cartoony kind of style of graphics in there as well they've gone for. You do get the original music as well, which is lovely. Uh, not for the overscreen, they put a new kind of piece of music in for the overscreen. So yeah, it looks like you get 12 minutes, so I'll, I'll show off what I can. Now, you've got a scroll, this is a new thing as well, look, you've got the scroll, which is really nice. Uh, as you scroll right in, it looks a little bit messy, but it still, it, it holds up. What you want to be using to get around, it's much faster, look, it's very slow to move around using the actual up and down, so just use your, your keyboard keys. Now, the first gripe people, uh, most people I've heard were having was the foundations. They, I mean, they can be a little bit tricky. I mean, people who are used to Constructor, you click once with the left mouse button and then move it around. But I don't know, I haven't found it's too bad. If you want to move the property over somewhere else, you just right click and kind of drag it out. I haven't found too many problems with it just yet. But I think it might be a bit harder when you're trying to do much bigger places. And yeah, you do get, you do get the, here we go. Hello. The original voices. That's nice. They they just use them in there. Uh, is he gonna? Yep, yeah, it is. It's all the original voices. I mean, uh, I know. Uh, I prefer that they didn't. No, I didn't want to run back there. Just turn auto. Where's the auto button? Is this auto? Yeah, that's auto on him. So I'm glad they didn't re-record them and change them. That you know that would have ruined it. But I don't know. They just they sound a little bit like could have spent a bit more time on them. Here you go, I'll let this guy talk a little bit. I am a big fan of the voiceover they've done. They've re-recorded, or not re-recorded, they've put some new voice acting in here. And that's really good. That does sound really spiffing. And the, as you see, the little HD kind of, uh, where is he? Here we go, yeah, look, this, this little HD window, which is nice. The building window, as you can see now, doesn't take up all of the screen, so... That's kind of a welcome uh, welcome thing. Uh, let's move in a tenant. I'll just show you. Here we go. Yeah, I don't need to hear him again. You get a nice little voice part here from both slobs and greasers. They've changed the greasers around a bit. I prefer, I was a more fan of the classic slobs. But you do get, here we go. You got a little case file on them now, which is nice. So you can read all about them. Uh, let's get some workers on the breed. Here, this is another nice thing. It's, this has just been given a complete HD upgrade, basically. Going through the rooms. It got the, still got the classic constructor music, which is banging. 
So let's get you boys in here. I also want to uh, build up my work team because it's a lot faster. It makes a lot of difference in this game now. It didn't used to make too much difference in the old one, whether you had a full team or not. In this one, it definitely does. You can really see how fast and slow things are building without them. So let's have a look. Let's go on to the main screen. I'm a massive fan of all this, all they've built in this background. Well, look, there's in the old construction, you did get a couple of estates that had extra bits on them, but they've really gone to town now. This looks cool. And, and it's as you'd expect, you know, these estates aren't ready to be built on. Look at those cheeky yellows. They've got all the, all the land. That's the best plot you want. I'm on uh, Katie Swallows, which is the classic constructor plot. I'm glad they've kept the names of them. So this is the one I've built. And looks like they keep all this stuff on there until you actually build land and stuff as well, which is nice. So let's start building up. Uh, I'm trying to give a good overview of the game as well as <laughs> complete well, as far as I can get in 10 minutes as well. So bear with me. Uh, it's called another work team in here. It, one thing I do notice, it doesn't look like you can upgrade these at the moment. I don't know whether it's just for the demo play, but look, the timber yard cannot be kind of upgraded like you used to be able to upgrade it. So I'm hoping that comes back. I'm hoping they bring that back because it would be a shame if you don't get that. Hello. So I want more slobs, basically. I want to wait till some of these complain because you get a really lovely voice acting from the slobs as well. So let's just get you guys onto level one tenants. I don't know why I'm bothering. I've got like seven minutes left to do this, but I'll just uh, I'll just show what it looks like. I might upgrade that one again as well. Actually, you know what? No, I'm going to upgrade the slobs one again because workers are good. You always want to have workers. Here we go. I've got a complaint from them. That's <laughs> that's good. So here, look, you've got the little little. Listen to this. Blimey, I can barely hear myself think. Turn it down, will ya? Shaggy Gort, they've kept that. Uh, they've kept the court, the uh, cheeky, sarcastic names in as well. Yeah, just come in here and we'll upgrade his house. You can see his complaints by and let's have a look. Icon to the left. I think they're going to all stay exactly the same. But I'll come back to this. Trophy, no more complaints. That's right, customer. They got a little trophy thing as well. That's cool. That'll be nice. So uh, I consider myself quite a pro at Constructor Source. So if I can gain up all of those... And you can watch my playthrough of the originals if you wish. I'll link that as well. A bit of shameless self-promotion, why not? And let's have a look, see what the this looks like. That, oh, superior. Did I upgrade it three times? No, this looks different. Ah, see, this is different from the other one. That's cool. Let's whack it in there once more. That bedroom looks different. Oh, they have changed it about a little bit. This doesn't. This is the same. That's cool. Okay, cool. There's a little bit of change here and there. Now, I want to show the Take fences. Break. The fences are different. You have to do this. Here we go. Fences like this. It's cool. You get the like, little window you can look through. These, now this is also something that's different. I mean, this coral fence was something the enemy used to be able to have on the original game. And the slatted wooden fence, but you couldn't have it. You only got the picket and the country hedgerow. Look, there's also two types of hedge as well, which is amusing. But, I mean, there's got to be more hedges than the, and fences than this, surely. On the game, I did. <laughs> it's a small thing, but it's a it's a cool thing. Uh, having that. Oh, it's, see, I didn't know you could do that. I've actually just moved over, and uh, you can do all the all the hedges at once, which is kind of cool. Didn't know you could do that. I need to call a work team. No, it's a Vic a Vic tenant, isn't it? I call you out. You should just automatically start work and call you out here. So yeah, that was that. The enemy fences were the slatted wooden fence. It looked terrible. It looks worse than the building fence in my mind. But you know, uh, but you used to, you know, when you used to upgrade the timber factory, etc., then you would get access to more fences and more gadgets. So I don't know how that's going to work on this. I'll see if I can speed through and see if we can get to that part. I think the foundation is. Yeah, that one's a bit too big. It'll lean over the edge and I don't want it to do that, so let's do there. Is that the same? It's a bit hard to tell with these trees in, to be honest. It doesn't matter, I've got bloody seven minutes or five minutes left, so who cares? Okay, let's call someone in here and let's try and get through enough of this to show it off. Let's call you. What are you about? Here. That was that was half the joy of Constructor Total Auto Repair League. If you hover over it, it will tell you, was the voices and the humour. So I'm really hoping they keep all of that. 
Am I going to run out of wood? Yeah, they only need quite three units, don't they? Let's click on the tenant. Yeah, they use, just do the same thing with HD. You will need to send a I know. Team back to the to so, the, yeah, the tutorial, you'll see if you've pre-ordered, you'll get the tutorial. And you'll see that. Oh, cool, we've got the punks. Due to the high of your That's games, the hippies. The That's the punks. You build some Listen, you. Let's get the greasers in just to show you them. The greasers are different. I wonder if it's them that's complaining immediately. No. One of your yeah, I know. It's just going to be them again, isn't it? So, you can see he's move him out. Oh, Let's see. Your can your I just build bed. up? Oh, I've got like four minutes left. Should be able to. Oh, that's just my overview of my houses. I'm hoping the missions are actual missions as well and not just, uh, what's the word? Uh, just like they had missions on the old game that weren't really missions. They were just kind of play styles. Like with a small end goal, I hope the missions are actually kind of mob brawl style missions. That would be good. So let's build that. Oh, I don't have enough wood. The interface is a lot better. A lot. Uh, I like the interface a lot more. Let's go and have a look at what the enemy are doing. They're... Oh, I thought they'd built on this land, like a massive plot of land like that. That's absolutely ridiculous. Have they kept the other HQs in as well? Yeah, that's... That's repairman. Oh, no. <laughs> repairman active is just what's going on in my state. This is really nice as well. Look, this this kind of updated map looks really good. Yeah, I wanted to see how far I can get with this. And oh, look, good. Oh, here we go. So this is actually giving me all the amenities. That's the park. They don't let you see all this just yet. But there should be. They're not going to show you, it, are they? That's cool. And the undesirables. I can build the undesirables places as well. That's nice. That's nice. At the moment, I'm just going to focus on getting Gadget Factory and seeing how that works out. I want to see if I can get the dog huts as well. That is major importance. Yep. I know. You're all pissed off. Let's piss off these other people instead. Does it... Oh, I can't see if the if it, the timer runs down with the complaints. If you get... Uh, say in some of them, if it have given you 62 days to solve it and then you go back and cause the problem again, sometimes it will run down. To like 32 days or whenever you completed it. Two and a half minutes left. So <laughs> there's not much time to show off really what you can do. And it's locked. Each day you only get 10 minutes so you can only get so far. But you know that's okay. That's It's a good way to um, preview the game. Let's have a look at how... <laughs> it's cool. So you never saw all of that going on. Or as much going on in the old one. I really do hope that you can upgrade them though. Yeah, computers. Okay, so looks like you've got. Looks like they're only allowing you to build certain gadgets at the moment. Maybe once I've built that or got those gadgets, it will unlock a few more. I don't know. They might only want you getting so far in the game. It does seem like that way, doesn't it? Yeah, they're not allowing any other things to go on. Who's complaining now? Yeah, I heard that guy before. Now then, the kids are getting burnt in the sun. All red and swollen <laughs> they are. Two trees for them to sit under would be lovely. They've uh, they've updated the game does pause when you're in um, when you're in messages as well. They've updated a few of these complaints, they've added a few more in, which is quite cool. I like that. So who's it's this guy he's complaining about. His kids being swollen and red, isn't he? Let's have just to uh, stop everyone complaining. Oh, you can put deciduous trees in as well. Oh, look, it's got a different floor plan. That's that's good. It's different from the other one, uh, from Constructor. It would just show you the same floor plan, but would actually be larger. There we go. You lot should all stop complaining. And... See, I do get extra houses to build, but the problem is you don't get, uh, you don't get any computers to upgrade, so it's just whack a massive council flat here and I've built it so I've, I've buggered that up because I just clicked it there see <laughs> I've fallen victim to this now myself haven't I uh, basically if you if you double if you click once then it will just lay the foundation so for all my uh, saying it wasn't that bad it's no good yes yes I know your kids getting burnt you're not even having any kids so I've given you some things oh good you get two postmen at once maybe even three that's good because on the old one you have to wait 
wait for them to uh, go and deliver things by hand, one by one. That's nice, that's nice. Uh, are you going to get penalised on this game for having too many in production in HQ, I wonder? That I don't know. Now, you'll see when the timer runs down, you will actually start to get attacked. It's, it's quite a novel way of throwing you off the demo. I'll give them that. <laughs> so, uh, have a watch. They really love this song as well. They, uh, they really blast this out and put it on as many things as they can by those of things. I bet they only use it for the demo as well, though, which is really, really funny. Oh, they actually give you some, some of these tenants. Okay, cool. Yeah, what'll happen is you'll get attacked now and they'll blow your place up. Who's there complaining immediately? Probably about the fence. Oi, your factory's been going day and night. We can't stay in the noise no more. Close it down for a bit or give us some double that, glazing. <laughs> that's the wrong uh, that's the wrong voice. That's not right. That's <laughs> that's the level two tenants and that they, they haven't given the right voiceover. So uh, that's not good enough for really, it, is it? No, no, that, that's not, one, that's not the right complaint, and two, that's not the right voice. Well, oh well, oh, before I get blown up, uh, let's, let's see if they care if it's a privet hedge, oh, something's on fire, but I don't think it's mine, oh look, you can see, oh, he's got a little fire sign there, that's good, that'll tell you what's going on. I want to have a look at the, oh, bugger, now they're not complaining, I can't. That's cute. <laughs> Gold that's cool that's cool i mean yeah they've, they've kept the they kept the humor uh, i like it i like this they've got a little case file on everyone i'm gonna i'm gonna spend a good time uh, delving into these <laughs> that's cool that's cool i like it i like it i like it you can read that and i'll read it my, in my own time oh no here comes a psycho look enemy psycho what else is on fire? It's not me. He's going to come down. I think, yeah, I think they're taking out all of the estates as well as not just mine. While he's doing this, I better. Is there a yeah manual repair? Yeah, let's just do that. You start off with a lot more cash as well in this one. Thing is, he's gonna, he's just gonna blow that thing up, and I can't stop him. And yeah, he's also blowing up this place as well. Can I repair my HQ? I can. Eight grand. That's a lot of money to repair an HQ. Uh, it's basically going to be over uh, very shortly because they are look they're sending out more and more. They're just going to come and destroy everything basically. Yeah, boom! I do like the explosions in this one as well. They look a lot better than the first one, don't they? There's not much you can do to stop them though. Complaints everywhere, and my HQ is going to go boom, and I'm going to be dead. But a novel way, a novel way of <laughs> wow, that was loud. Uh, a novel way of ending the demo, I think. And now you get the updated HD exit. Oh, bad luck. Your HQ was blown to smithereens. Sweet dreams. So there you go. This was the constructor demo. Well, it wasn't the demo, but it was the, the demo that you can play. The playable demo. Uh, as usual, I've been letting them come in it. If you've enjoyed this, do check out some of my other videos. I've got lots of constructor and mob rule stuff. And uh, poetry about video games as well. A bit of an odd concept. So, uh... Yeah, I look forward to seeing the, the final Constructor product, which will be out next week. And uh, join me for that as well, if you fancy it. So, until next time, thank you and good night. I'll leave you with the Buried Alive exit video. A loser RIP, indeed. <laughs> it looks good, it does look good. There you have it. So, until next time, thank you and good night.